One of the ways to combat this, I'll know it when I see it, is to show it to them. Show them a data set and say, if we have this data in phase two, would you fund us? Because it's hard for non-statisticians to think about the quantitative aspects of what is a predictive probability of success? What does this mean? What does that mean? But if I can see the data, if I can see the effect size, that's meaningful to me. So we show them a data set and say, would you fund it if we showed you this data set? Sometimes they say, you know, I also need to see this. Okay, we'll show you that as well. Would you fund it? Say, you know, if we see this data, we would fund it. Okay, how about this data set? Would you fund this data set? And we show them example data sets, Kaplan-Meier plots of what data might look like, estimated hazard ratio, difference in proportions, mean changes. We show them these data, and then you show them thousands. You show them scatter plots of the various effect sizes. And then you say, by the way, this point right here that you would fund, the predictive probability of success is 82% or it's 63%, and they get to understand it, it meaningful to them. I know it when I see it through that quantity because it's now familiar to me.